Hi guys, let's talk about being different and being okay with it. So actually we are all pretty unique people and we are all very different from each other and I think that it's awesome and being unique is very um, brave in a way but I have problems with that and my therapist gave me some really good advice and I felt that it would be just really mean not to share it with you so we were talking about me being most comfortable when I am completely on my own because it is the only time when I do not compare myself to other people and this is when I'm the happiest with myself and she also told me to like look around and see my group of friends and realize that they are all really different people and they are all unique in a way like not normal as you might say and that it also resonates with the fact that I am pretty different from like an average person and I'm not saying that I'm better than the average I'm just saying that I sent out in a lot of things that may be considered good or bad but it doesn't change the fact that i'm kind of like different from an average 24 year old girl i would say so i see it as as a scientist i always have like graphs in my head that explain stuff so i see people in general like there is a big um graph of lots of lots of dots where people can be placed and there is like a medium line which is sort of an average of every person that ever existed and some people are on this line but not a lot of people are on this line but there is like an area above and below this line that most of the people fit into this category and this is considered like normal so uh, a normal person your age like your parents maybe told you one day like a normal person your age does this and this and that and like or what you see most people doing most people interests like there is more like popular or normal things and there are less popular or normal things that people want or do or are and some people are way out of this area above and below the line and it can bring you a lot of joy and a lot of troubles as well so if you are one of the people who are different from others or if you just are a regular normal person you might have some quirks or some things that make you stand out and you maybe want to change them about yourself to blend in it is completely your right to do so and i think that it is very comfortable to be accepted by the crowd and we are social creatures we want to be accepted above all so it is all okay but if you are not doing a very good job like me on like in blending in with other people and being normal <laughs> then you might as well just embrace the fact that you're weird or different or you know so lots of people who are different in some way are bullied in school and i think that you need to have a lot of bravery to overcome this and in order to kind of stay true to yourself and not try to change in order to get more accepted or in order to like blend in i was never bullied in school thank god whatever um i was actually quite popular but i was still different and i don't know how that happened but the fact that people who are weird and unique and different who stand out they attract more attention and most of the actors or models or painters or something like the ones that were the weird ones the crazy ones the, these are the ones that are remembered and people get more attracted to the things that they don't know and that they're not familiar with because there is this interest and there is this like i want to know more about this magical wonderful being whatever so if you are different just remember that if you stay true to yourself and if you are okay with yourself being different that might be considered very attractive by a lot of people and you might draw very interesting people to yourself and then again when you are yourself you attract the people who match you and when you're not trying to be someone that you're not in order to just be like everyone else or blend in 
then of course you will have more friends probably or you will have normal friends but that they will not be the people that spark something inside of you or that are really with you because they like you for you they will like you for this false projection the false image of you that is not real my therapist gave me some tips on how to accept your uniqueness and your being weird and different and not wanting to be like everyone else because i still like i'm a i'm a grown ass woman i still want to be like everyone else i'm still scared of the teenage girls on the streets because i have like teenager flashbacks i always wanted to be like among the cool girls group whatever so in order to accept your uniqueness do not compare yourself to anyone else i think i sound like a broken record because i talk about it in my every video but comparison is the thief of joy and you are not meant to be like the other person so please don't compare yourself to anyone else know your strong sides and work on them and also know your flaws and as okay as important it is to accept your flaws and i think that the things that you cannot change about yourself you need to accept but when people tell you you have to like love yourself for who you are and you have to accept yourself fully i think that you still need to work on yourself all the time in order to become a better person at least that's what i feel about myself i really feel much better when i know that i'm doing something in order to become a better person or in order to become better at something and i know that it is more uh rewarding than just saying well they need to love me for me because duh like i mean people don't really owe you anything so like try to become better at what you are but still staying unique i think it is very hard but i mean we are all here struggling so maybe it's worth trying and it takes a lot of courage to be unique and to stand out and to not try to become like everyone else so you have to be very courageous and i applaud you if you embrace your weirdness and uniqueness and welcome to the club and i will work on this because i still have problems with it and i still am like a chameleon a social butterfly whatever i try to make people like me and not always for who i am so i still need to work on being more authentic and being more myself in front of other people and i encourage you to do the same thing so i hope that this video was not entirely like offensive please i didn't mean to offend anyone by this i love every single one of you even if you fit into this normal group if you do not fit i love you all equally and i think that the most important thing is loving yourself and loving the other people and being kind so please don't get it the wrong way if you did i'm sorry if i offended someone and thank you so much for watching this video i love you guys so 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 much be nice humans and see you in the next video goodbye